Good morning. When we launched Nintendo DS and Wii over the last several years, we stated a goal of expanding the gaming population. And today, we have seen changes in who play, where we play, and most importantly, how we play. The boundary that once divided players by age group or personality, or even by gender, are starting to be erased. But, mental boundaries still exist in how game systems are defined. Some hardware is seen as appropriate for only the most active passionate players. Others, like we, they say, seem to attract a large number of more casual gamers. As an industry, what we haven't achieved yet is a game platform that is equally satisfying for all players. Yet, this is exactly what we intend to create with our new home platform. How might that happen? I will suggest two words, deeper and wider. The new platform will provide deeper game experiences than what even the most passionate gamer has realized before. And it will offer wider appeal to gamers, wider even than for we. And as you will begin to understand this week, it will let everyone see games in a different way. We are going to leave the full details for a little later this morning. But I wanted you to understand that for Nintendo, the goal of innovation is to serve every player, even though each brings to video games an individual appetite, a personal passion, and a distinct gaming history. I believe our new platform represents a major step toward reaching our goal. However, our new home console is the product to look forward to next year. This year, there are bold new experiences coming for Nintendo 3DS and several, uh, several of the franchises you know so well are moving into 3D. Thank you.